Hey y'all, Decamon here, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Last time! Well, I was right. We were basically gonna get thrown right into it the moment I went to sleep, so you know, I'm glad I stopped where I did. Also, Roach is back! That's fun. And Yuffie's, like, been contracted to kill the new president of Shinra Corp? That's not gonna end well, especially since Rufus is actually pretty darn tough if I remember that little fight we had with him all the way back in Midgar. Uh, also, we have a new area that we've been exploring, this little, like, condor fort area, which I think is your crow's nest. Uh, this is the condor area, Condor Hill, to be specific. Why am I up here? Well, because I have one last side quest, and apparently it's rather involved in just the number of steps. So let's get this out of the way first. Oh, ho! Care to join us, young lady? We've got a lovely breeze blowing today. You certainly do. So, what are you all looking at? We're on the lookout for the Great Condor. Hmm? If we try to catch sight of it every time it takes flight, make sure it's in good health and all that. It's not really a danger to people, but its hunger can drive it to hunt larger prey. Um. Let's just hope it never develops a taste for us. <laughs> Too late there if that's the bird we saw when we first entered Junon. It's filled with fun facts about our beloved bird. I'm quite proud of it. Sir, I don't think the condor is going to show today. Maybe we should head back. No, let's wait a little longer, lad. That bird's got me a bit worried. Haven't seen it in a fair while now. Hmm. I wonder if we should have given it something to eat after all. Perhaps. I put a post up on the notice board asking for help, but... Well, that's why we're here. Well, if you're still looking for volunteers, we'd be more than happy to help. Well, far be it for me to turn down such an offer. <laughs> uh, oh right, uh, also last time we found out that Queen's Blood might secretly be evil, and might also secretly be Yu-Gi-Oh, and therefore evil. It's a grand old bird. Makes its nest in a small island just a stone's throw from here. Hmm. Even saved my life back when I was a lad, if you can believe it. The condor was looking out for me that day, so I thought I should start looking out for it. Keep tabs on its well-being and whatnot. Okay. It's a proud creature, a hunter at heart. We've tried to feed it before, but it seems to prefer catching its own prey. If something smelled enticing enough, though, it might be moved to come and take a closer look, I suspect. I still think this was the bird that snatched up one of the black crows when we first got here. Back during the war, I was running from some Shinra troopers when one of them got me in the back. I fell to the ground. I thought I was done for until that bird snatched me up and flew me to the next town over. <laughs> I sometimes wonder if it mistook me for its supper. I never managed to regain the use of my legs, unfortunately. Oh. But I feel my spirit soar when I watch that condor fly. I may be stuck here, but at least they're still free. All right, let's deal with this. Thank you. I appreciate it. One of the condor's favorite hunting spots is in the woods nearby. You'll need a chocobo that can manage the climb to get there. It's pretty tough. That's not a problem. The woods nearby, you say? Well, that's actually, conveniently, a fast travel point that I, once again, was like, what is this all about? So now we know. It's for this quest line. That's why this little fast travel spot is here. All right. Beef. Look, over there. Quietly approach the cow. But I don't want to quietly approach the cow. I want to come charging at it full steam ahead. Uh, where you going, buddy? There goes the condor's dinner. Maybe we can track its scent. <laughs> oh, hey, buddy. There we go. I mean, clearly we saw it run this way, so beyond that, it's not that difficult. Where is my beef at? Where'd you go? Where did he go? Holy crap. Down past the chocobo stop. Where? Where is he? 
Ah, there he is. We got things trying to eat my cow. No, the only thing that's allowed to eat my cow is the giant birdie. Dick. Going in. Had enough? Keep it together. I'll take care of them. And catch. This one's for you. There we are. All right, Mr. Cow, time for... Oh, that ain't no condor. Dang, Nabbit. That's what this quest is going to be. It's going to be me chasing this cow. The chocobo could track him. <laughs> That's your response and not... Well, shit. That's my response. Oh, that's a bad sound. That's a bad sound. There seems to be a fiend nearby. No shit! Your chocobo is too scared to enter the cave. Well, after that roar, I'd be a little scared to enter the cave. Actually, you know what? Let's change the group around a little bit. Uh, Barrett hasn't had much fun. Alright, where is this beastie? There it is. Mystic Dragon! Take the lead. Need my help. Alright, what do we got? Wind or wind weakness. Inflicting enough damage will pressure, but once pressured it will fly high into the air. Ah. Uh you got wind on you? You do not. That's a little disappointing, but it's understandable. I'll show you what I can do. One more shot. Who's up for some Get him. This one's for you. One more shot. <laughs> uh, have I mentioned how much I love this thing? It is hilarious. Why don't you leave it? You'll be blown away. Oh, that did some damage. Deal with that. About damn time. Want some more? Oh. Oh, for you. I'll take care of them. And that's all I wanted to see. Come on, team. Watch this. All right. Get ready. Keep it up. This is now. Nice, very nice. Give it all you can can doing good, doing good. Ooh, we have a synergy we can fire? Yeah, good old firework blade. Uh yeah, we've done United Refocus before. Let's get this guy. <laughs> oh, you gotta love those attacks. They are hilarious watching. <laughs> they are just bockers. I'll show you what I can do. Tagging out. Enjoy the ride. There we go. That was easy. What do we do now? Uh. Choose an item to take. <laughs> Wait, what? I got a pick? Oh, fuck me. Uh, I hope it likes ABC. I was like, Condor, I don't think gonna be taking greens, and Monster Flesh is probably tainted with Mako and all sorts of nasty shit. <laughs> so here's hoping that this is the right answer. Now, where's this going? Oh, it's going all the way back here. Okay, sir, I have the meat. Oh, you're back. Hope it wasn't too much trouble. You can put the food right over there. Thank you. 
You place the condor's food on the pedestal. This is quite the cut of meat. I have no doubt the bird will be unable to resist the call of such fine dining. Alright, that makes me think I got the right choice. I mean, condors are not herbivores, or eh, they might be omnivorous, but I think they're mostly carnivores. And like I said, the monster meat's probably tainted I with Mako and all sorts of weird shit. Looking up and seeing a blue sky. Eats a steel one, that's for sure. Ain't that the truth. <laughs> Though at least with a steel sky you know your limits. Out here, it's endless. I kind of get what Aerith was saying now. Yeah, maybe. Hey, look! Hmm? Oh shit, it is the giant bird that took the black robe. <laughs> what a sight. I never dreamed I'd be able to see it up close like this. Ah, uh, up oh. Wait, we have to get a photograph. Grab the camera. And turn the flash yes, off or you'll scare it. Gather around, everyone. Quickly, quickly. Say cheese. Oh. <sighs> what? Good lord, ma'am. Are you all right over there? Oh, so, snap any good shots? I hope so. It just showed up. I could barely hold my camera and... Really? Couldn't tell from a shot like this. So she actually did good. Here, I thought she was freaking out and they'd all be blurry. Oh. <laughs> well, I haven't looked this happy since I was a lad. It's precious moments like these that make condor watching so exhilarating. You never know what to expect. Well, scouts, let's finish writing up today's report and start preparing for our next fateful encounter. Sir! And hopefully next time we'll be able to snap a clear picture of that bird. Sir! <laughs> I'd like you to have this as a souvenir. Oh, that's actually a good <laughs> shot. Oh, warning materia. Nice face, Cloud. Nice. That's actually damn well worth it. Oh. Tifa's already up to three stars. Damn. Look at us kicking ass here. All right. With that. All the side quests that I know of are cleared, and it's time to head back all the way over here to the main scenario, which I will probably ignore for a wee bit until I get my last freaking Queen's Blood person out of the way. And I gotta drop off Snap's little picture, because I did that off screen. It's not, that was nothing interesting. It was just go there, turn on photo mode, turn off photo hey, mode, and... What were you thinking sending Sam back alone like that? He even need us in the first place? Your mother gives Stamp a run for his money. <laughs> so, how's my son? Seem okay? Yeah. You gonna stand there and pretend this wasn't all about Claire and her bun in the oven? <laughs> Apple didn't fall far from this stubborn ass tree. That's for damn sure. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't know about that. And if you're done making wisecracks, I got work to do. Ah, that was sweet. <laughs> yes, that was clearly all about Claire. All right, now next things up. Houses. Snaps. There you are. Hey there! Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. Good going. Association was impressed too. Bumped you up a rank. Your technique isn't exactly where it needs to be, but you've got promise, that's for sure. If you can develop your talents more, I guarantee you'll go places. <laughs> you are now a budding photographer. Awesome. Alrighty. Uh, so where is this other person? Let's check up top. Yep, there they are. They just showed up on the mini-map. Or they are. Hi. Yeah, probably. Oh, hey there, mister. Are you looking for someone to play Queen's Blood with? We'd be more than happy to go a round or two with you. I'm Devin, the younger brother. And I'm Darren, the older one. And together, we're the Double D Duo. <laughs> a team of twins who love Queen's Blood. Okay, you two You'll definitely need to change that name. First. Holy crap. <laughs> I'll take you on. Two for the price of one. Sweet deal, right? Speaking of prices, if you lose against either of us, you gotta fork over three gil. I think I could deal with three gil. <laughs> Little hustlers here. Oh, no reward! 
I gotta put up three gil and these little brats aren't gonna put up a card? Fine. I suppose I can deal with these two. Seriously, double D duo? Um, pretty sure that's what Aerith nicknamed her you know what. Uh, I'm not actually gonna toss one of these. Yeah, I'm just gonna toss one of these Levicrons. I don't need both of them in the opener. Besides, I'd rather use the Cactar right off the bat. <laughs> I see someone else favors the Cactar Gambit. I was gonna watch if she played, if she suddenly played a mirror of what I was playing. I was like, oh god. There we go. Hmm. Claim in my turf. Oh, sir, you have lost this game. <laughs> you have lost the game. What? I put Chocobo down. He's going to be, what, a two natively? Uh, if I put this down, I basically just have. Oh, let's do this. Now the Chocobo is only worth three. Oh, or it doesn't matter, we win. I can play Shiva for the coup de gras, but it seems unnecessary. <laughs> the twins, it, they just couldn't stand a chance. Not bad, but next, you gotta beat me. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I gotta, this is a duo worry, fight? Devin. I promise I'll avenge you. Ah, there's my card. That explains why you weren't offering a card for the first match. This was a 2v1 to begin with. Let's see if this one is the second kid's any better. Uh, actually, this is a pretty good opener. Sir, I see you advancing through my territory, and I do not like it. Uh, you should never play that as a top row card, sir. You should never, never play that as a top row card. Oh, he just murked his own cards. Hmm. Interesting. Not sure I like that strategy, but, you know. If you want to be the fool, you can be the fool. play this, I lose access to that spot pretty much for good. That's fine. Yeah. Lower the power. I already did anything. I'm just not impressed. I'm not impressed by your play, sir. They reek of mediocrity. And now I win the game. <laughs> Jeez. 
These characters do not know how to defend against a push. That's definitely what I've been finding. They do not know how to defend against a proper push. Thank you for the ogre card. Aww, I can't believe we lost. You're better at this than I thought. Hold up. Does this mean we don't get our three kill? Nope. Oh, he totally still owes us. I'm pretty sure the deal was if we lost, we got three gil. Isn't that right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. You may have beaten us this time, but we'll get that three gil from you yet. So if you're ever in the mood, come back and play. Oh, goodness gracious. The little hustlers here. Seriously. <laughs> also, we are now rank four. Whew. And we are just climbing the ladder. All right. That's pretty much everything. So we just need to go to the coastline and Gabe's pick up the main mission. Shush, Gabe. I'm glad to see you're enthusiastic, but I do not need you at the moment. All righty. Elevator's been shut down, so Yes, 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 yes. Oh, <gasps> she's playing with the dolphin. Oh, hey, you guys. We talked to Yuffie. She said that you could show us a way to get up top. Sure, I'd be happy to. Although, Yuffie's the one who found it. Mm -hmm. And according to her, that tanker's the quickest and easiest way into the city. The tanker? See that? That booth up there is the control room. So we can repurpose this ship as an elevator. <laughs> Someone lowers and sends it back up, along with the others. Problem is... How are we supposed to get to the controls? Swim. High voltage? Yep. It should just say, no climbing. <laughs> so we're stuck. Not with Mr. Dolphin. You wouldn't believe what he can do. Like... Like when we met. See, I was out taking a swim all on my lonesome. At least I thought I was alone. But then, squeak, squeak. I hear this funny noise. That's great and all, but we're in a hurry. Hey. Jeez, man. Even the oh, dolphin's sorry. pouting. Really? But we'll make sure to come back as soon as we're done. You can finish your story then. How does that sound? Okay, promise. <laughs> hmm? Never done it before? My arm, your arm, bam. Oh? Oh, gotcha. Eh. <laughs> Not quite a fist <laughs> bump, but we'll take it. All right, then. Now what? Now, we ask Mr. Dolphin to get you up. With his help, it'll be a cinch. Oh my goodness. Okay, which one of you wants to go flying? Uh... Got you ridden all over it, Merc. Oh, lucky me. Guess it's me. <laughs> Great, just let me know when you're ready to go. Oh my... Good to go! You will not be able to return to Under Junon for some time. Well, I'm glad I did everything beforehand. Level 23? Really? The recommended level for this is 23? Uh, also, where did these suddenly come from? Mr. Dolphin! Mr. Dolphin! You, uh, you're swimming away from me! <laughs> come on, man! All right, jumping with Mr. Dolphin. Steer Mr. Dolphin into the beach balls. He loves so much to get him excited and speed him up. If you're swimming fast enough by the time he reaches the goal, he'll be able to launch Cloud up to the control room. Uh, R2 for high speed turns. Come on, Cloud, you got this. Dear God, is this another mini game? I think it. Is. Yep, it is another goddamn mini game. Ah. Speed up! Oh, I see. Oh, I missed that ball. I missed that one too. Shit. Hopefully I'm going fast enough. Dick!
I don't know if I'm going fast enough! And jump! Whee! Oh god, again? And Cloud <laughs> nails the landing. <laughs> Take a bow, buddy. I think you earned it. That was adorable. That was adorable! All right, now, how do you work this thing? Oh dear, cloud and heavy machinery. Oh gods. Oh god, oh well, that's not surprising. This thing is slower in dog water. It's heavy. It's lifting a giant tanker ship. Of course it's gonna be slow. <sighs> Lower the tanker into the cove. Yeah, I'm working on that. It's just taking its sweet ass time. My goodness. <sighs> there should be a note there that says, by the way, this thing was being serviced and was leaking oil like crazy. Lowering it into the water has created an economical disaster. Okay. Or, uh, Your ride's right here. Eco disaster, I should the say. Ship's not economic. Far, That's not so right. you'll be there in no time. Oh. Oh my goodness. Think on the way. Oh, shut up, Barrett. <laughs> the dolphin is adorable. Red, please do not fall in the water. I, I'm not sure if you don't, if you like work under Charmander rules or not, you just die instantly if your tail flame goes out. Uh, boat might be a little lopsided here. You've been a huge help, Priscilla. No prob. Well, guys and girls, and, uh, dog, I'll see you later. Whee! <laughs> Have fun! Have fun? Have fun murdering! Oh, goodness. Hey, Mark, we're good to go down here. All right, now, yeah, which way's up? Oh, right, up. But I have to literally manually up this thing? I do have to literally manually up this thing. That is, that is sad. It is sad that I have to manually up this thing. And how the hell am I supposed to get up there, huh? You're just gonna... Wow. Bye! Meet you at the top. <laughs> and Cloud's like, wait, how am I supposed to get to the top again? Oh, okay, I don't have to hold up anymore. <laughs> the cutscene took over for me, thankfully. Junon proper, finally. Oh god, that is a big gun. Uh, somebody's compensating for something fierce. Oh. Oh, hi. We, uh, we have a serious procession going on here. Oh, this is pre-rendered, I just noticed. This looks way too good for uh, performance mode. <laughs> there he is. Baby Shinra and Heidecker. Hey, <laughs> I was hoping we were done with this jerk, but I can't get that lucky. Still a scumbag. All right, join up with the others. That seems so simple. Am I gonna have to play some solo cloud for a little bit? Oh, hi, there's everybody. Oh, that was short-lived. Ah, there you are. Let's move. Infiltration. 
<laughs> Vending machine? Ooh. High ether. Oh. Uh oh. It's about to become a scrap. Hey guys, don't mind us. The new president in person. Wow, they are really observant. <laughs> or they just don't care. It's like, hey guys, isn't that avalanche? Yeah, but they don't pay us enough to deal with this. Wow. How do you aim something that big? Less security than I thought. More worried about the parade? <laughs> Guess things have changed. They got higher priorities. Personally, I think that's a good thing. The city's size, on the other hand. The robed men won't be easy to find. They're definitely not here. Let's head into town. Hmm. Again, I should not be able to walk past these Shinra soldiers. We cannot let Midgar win. Not on our own home turf. What? Chunon Aerodrome Airstrip. Oh god, they... Any idea what that is? The highway. Shinra's pride and joy. The fastest, most advanced airship in the fleet. Screw the boat. Let's take that. <laughs> got a skills we don't know about? We're sticking with the boat. That's too bad. Would have been perfect. Hey, beggars can't be choosers. Good lord. Have you seen the engines on the high wind? That baby's got four of them, each with their own cooling unit. Oh my goodness. Rufus Shinra is a total hunk. Oh my. Good God, you're a woman. I never would have guessed. Oh. Marching practice! That's the ticket. Much better than yesterday. I don't think I've got anything more to add. Hmm? Do you need something? Elevator's just over there if you want to get back to town. Dude, seriously. You guys are really not observant. I never get tired of looking at that butte. <laughs> I really hope they're talking about the airship. Uh, sort of advice. Do not piss off Director Heidegger. No kidding. God, are they televising this? In either sector. Good. What about the passengers? We checked their IDs and screened all their luggage, sir. There was nothing out of the ordinary. Excellent. Now remember. Oh my god, they are broadcasting this. Going down! Uh, how about we steal this? <laughs> Probably a little more reliable than the boat. No, we'll leave them be. For now. Hmm. Is he talking about us, the black robes, or someone completely unrelated? Enter. Sung? Yep. An emissary from Wutai is here. Sent by Viceroy Saruf. Wutai? Oh? He introduced himself as Colonel Glenn Ladbrock. Oh, here I thought it would be Yuffie for half a sec. Gent? All right. That was an interesting flash back. Black robe. Uh-oh. He doesn't have the white symbol on the back like the others. Interesting. Whoa. Wait, is that the guy he shot in the flashback? I thought you were dead. <laughs> then you thought right. Uh-oh. Sefi, is that you? Let's cut to the chase, Mr. President. The Viceroy and your late father had big plans. 
I assume you intend to carry them out? Correct. Hmm? That's good to hear. Some people just don't have the stomach for war. And this battle for the Magnus Materia demands commitment from both Wutai and Shinra. Magnus Materia? Thank you. I'm aware. But my father is dead, which changes the equation. A new vision is required. <laughs> you always did prefer to march to the beat of your own drum. This new vision include your fairy tale promised land? <laughs> you Shinras, you take and you take, and you never give back. Left to you, this world would end up an empty husk. Uh oh. It's about to get but ugly, war isn't it? Can put things right, beget anger. Desolation, hatred, and in its wake, new unity. A people rejuvenated, and a planet once more made whole. What we're doing's for the greater good. Just gotta know when to ease off the gas. Now listen. You started this, remember? No more playing the idle air. You have obligations to fulfill. <laughs> Let's give the people what they deserve. Oh, right. Before I leave, a message from the Viceroy. Congratulations on your inauguration, Mr. President. Shinra has a bright future. <laughs> I am getting mad Emmett Selk vibes from this guy. I really am. And it makes it, and it almost sounds like Wu Tai and Shinra were plotting to go into war with each other. Huh. That's really wild. God, I wonder how much of that was in the original. All right. Oh wow, there's just stuff hanging around. Planet blessings. Why are there planet blessings here? Check each tag. Yes. What is it? Oh, are you trying to get to the town below? Just take the elevator. Man, some of these Shinra guys are really nice. Hopefully, a continent or two. Easy does it now. <laughs> that is insane. If that's true, and these guys are really planning to start some major shit. Huh. What in the heck is the guys plan? What in the heck are they thinking? Let's make sure what is this Magnus materia they were talking about? Alright, they said the elevator was over here? Remember that you represent Judah. It's our fun new era. Yeah, I don't think having a polished boot and helmet will save your life in a fight. I really don't. You know, unless you somehow manage to blind the enemy with the glare off your shiny helmet. So, Cloud, what can you tell us about Juno? It's a key military outpost with its own offshore reactor. A critical line of defense against any seaborne assault. When needed, it can transform into an armed fortress. Its strategic location, along with its air and sea ports, make it second only to Midgar's the company's most vital city. Mm -hmm. huh. Neat. Any good restaurants? Sights to see? Uh, maybe? I don't know. Oh, of course uh, not. Right. You're not the touristy type. Hey, just to be clear, you do realize we're not here on vacation, right? Uh, of course I do. <laughs> hey, look, what's that about? <laughs> hmm? Our 7th Infantry will return home with the President's commendation. Let's show him how a real drill team does it. And make our city proud. <laughs> Troopers, you're all off duty until the parade begins. But use this time wisely. Practice your technique. <laughs> hmm. 
Those guys are from Midgar. They might recognize some of us. That's a little concerning. Hey. Jesus, Red. Where the heck did you come from? Literally just manifested and pushed me out of the way. Also, I can feel this thing. I can straight up feel this elevator in my hands. Those troopers seemed pretty psyched for the parade, huh? More like eager to prance around for their new paymaster. <laughs> now, I know what y'all gonna say, but I gotta ask. What? If Rufus is in town, are we really gonna let this opportunity pass us by? Hmm. Hell, I'm not saying we kill the man, but we ought to at least give him a talking to. Rough him up a little, maybe, you know? <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna have to agree. Aerith? First, the Turks say, do whatever, we're not after you. But then, Cloud's biker buddy rolls up and says he is. We gotta straighten this out. Okay, but how? <laughs> Cloud's we can't biker just buddy. Up to the president in the street. Or maybe we can. What? <gasps> we bust up his parade. Oh, no. God. That's how we die in a hail of bullets like a bunch of dumbasses. <laughs> the city's crawling with Shinra troopers. We join the parade. Hide in plain sight. Are you kidding me? Get in, get close, get answers. Seriously? Sure. Wow, that's good. No arguments here. <laughs> Barrett. Red, you guys find a route to the port. See what security's like. And keep an eye out for black robes while you're at it. Now hold up! Fatigues won't be enough to disguise you two. He's not wrong. <laughs> you do kind of stick out. True enough. Shut up. <laughs> right, see you in a bit. I gotta go find a uniform. Three uniforms, apparently. Oh, we're coming with. I'm so pumped for this. <laughs> this way? Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, at least you're not going to end up in drag this time, Cloud. <laughs> or maybe you will. Maybe Attention they'll just find three female troopers. uniforms. Spare uniforms can be found here. Please get changed. The ceremony will be starting soon. Now we're talking. <laughs> Oh, You're actually goodness. kinda cool. Well, ready to suit up? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to end badly. Well, Three steps back, if you please. <laughs> They're gonna come out looking ridiculous, and I'm gonna have to fix their uniforms. Alright, where's mine? I'm here. Been a while. Yeah, he's probably used to this style of uniform. One quick change later. Come on, there we go. Hey, weapon safety, ladies. <laughs> well? Well? You got me. Hey, <laughs> You know, the buster sword is still gonna make us stick out like a sore thumb, right? Maybe. But don't forget, you gotta act the part, too. Just do what I do, all right? Also, shouldn't the three-eye thing be over their eyes so we can't see their faces? Like all the other Shinra soldiers? Head to Starboard Junon when you're ready. Better hurry. You don't want to be the reason your team is disqualified. Hmm. Oh yeah, there's that problem too. Hold it. Thing. But 
I don't recall seeing the three of you at practice. Am I to assume that you simply... forgot? Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. <laughs> You're sorry? Do you have any idea how important today's ceremony is? Do you maggot? Form check now. You will give your commander a flawless performance. Oh my gosh. And if you show her anything less than perfection, I'll feed your ass to a behemoth. <clears throat> Just follow my lead. I still remember the basics. I'm having second thoughts, you guys. What the hell are you doing over there? The commander is waiting! Sir! Man, th th this guy is like... Seriously... Pumped. Alright. Have to hand it to you three. You've got guts skipping out on practice. That, or you're idiots. Oh, we're definitely idiots. For thinking Let's we could pull this it, off. Shall we? I'm not about to take any chances today. I'm warning you now, though. One slip up and I'll chuck you straight into a Marlboro's mouth. Clear? Uh-oh. Performing in the parade! Press the corresponding button when the glowing guide connects with the panel to improve your drill team's synchronicity and impress the crowd. Red is tap. Yellow is mash. And blue is hold. Okay. This ought to be hilarious. It's the Queen Bee all over again. Let's see what you've got. Now, begin! Tap the button when the red line connects with the red diamond. <laughs> Step it up. We should zoom out a little bit so I can actually see these things coming a little sooner. There we go. Hold. Impressive. Ah, mash. Excellent. I see. I, I have to mash it enough times before it reaches the end. It's not mashed till it reaches the end. We'll take it. Damn near perfect. Nah, yeah, we're good. Precise, clean movements. Impeccable timing. There's no way you're part of my unit. Who the hell are you? And we're outed. <laughs> I must say, you've impressed me. <clears throat> He'd serve as a sterling example to the others, ma'am. Uh-oh. I've been drafted! Congratulations! You are hereby promoted to Parade Captain of Midgar 7th Infantry. <laughs> you will be our model trooper, the one to march at the head of our drill team. Which means that our performance, satisfactory or otherwise, is now your responsibility. Ah, shit. Ma'am. Oh. I'm trading up. <laughs> Ow, God. <laughs> Jeez, man, easy. <laughs> As parade, Captain, you will round up your fellow troopers currently on leave in Larvor Junon. You will recall that, to march in the parade, each drill team is required to muster five units or more. Look for the seventh Brassards. They'll identify the best from the rest. Hmm. Once assembled, you and the team will report to Starboard Junon. Tardiness will not be tolerated. Now, make us proud. Ma'am! Ma Ladies, I must say I'm impressed. You actually managed to deal with this. Ah, your parade performance. 
As parade captain, it falls to you to locate the seven infantry's disparate units and assemble your drill team. When you find at least five, you can fine tune your performance lineup with L2. Note that certain units unlock different formations. Successfully performing uh, more difficult formations will improve your rating. Oh. Uh, this just became a whole thing. No I in team. Looking 10 7th Infantry people? Hey, Shit. You sure about this? Is the parade really gonna get us to Rufus? The parade won't, but the presidential commendation will. That's how these things go. The president himself gives the award. Wow. That's some plan. I mean, it's risky, but gotta go big or go home, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, so what's the play here? I am, oh my fucking God. I am being let loose. I am being let loose. <laughs> Larbor Junon, Main Street. Am I gonna find 10 troopers in this crap hole? Cool. Ah, it's bright here. To rally the troops, Captain? Yeah, just remember, Midgard, 7th Infantry. Anyone with one of these guys, right? That's the ones. Come on. Oh, this is gonna be a thing. I gotta find 10 of these guys. Oh, where are they gonna be? Oh, there's one right there. All right. Everybody ready? Not yet. Let me fangirl for a sec. Oh my goodness. Oh, perfect timing, Captain. Would you mind taking the picture so I can get in there? Fine. Here, I'll take the picture. Whenever you're ready, sir. Boom. Thanks a bunch. Wow, Captain, who knew you were such a pro? I might just have to frame this. Huh. Right time's over, people. The parade's about to begin. Follow me. Yes, yes sir! No wonder Shinra keeps losing. Their officers are all a bunch of goofballs. Every one of them. They're nuts. They've got oh, hi. everything. Hmm? Well, let me guess. You're here for the limited model, too? Check the helmet, you dipshit. Oh, Captain, please forgive me, sir. Break time's over. Outside. Now. Right away, away sir. sir. It is a cool-looking uh, model, though. I will give them that. However, this also was an actual weapon shop? Greetings, Captain. In need of some new armaments? Well, that's assuming you have any. Uh, you do not. Worth a shot. Good luck out there, Captain. I'll be rooting for you. God. Girls, I thought you two were part of my uh, my drill team here for half a second. And I. Nope. Find what you needed, sir. Hope so, sir. Oh fuck. They're part of our sir. crew. Welcome back, sir. Welcome back, sir. I make the most of my time here after <laughs> traveling all this way. Ta-da! A stamp for me. Ooh, item shop. It's gonna be broadcast live in the dark. Can I help you find anything today? Yes, do you have any children's card game cards? You do not. A little disappointing. Feel free to keep browsing. We carry only the finest in materia here. Hmm. All of which I already have at least one of. We look forward to your next visit. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. It's gonna be broadcasting. Um, can I help you? <laughs> Captain? Guys, quick! Attention! Get your shit together. Parade's about to begin. Everyone, follow me. Yes, sir! <laughs> I cannot get over the marching. Ah, okay, yeah, they were part of that group too. Alright, we gotta keep looking around. Oh, God. Are they, uh, we're getting more. All right, anyone hanging out at the inn? Doesn't look like it. Welcome. 
Oh, hi. Welcome to the magical Magnata Books Junon location. If you're looking for some recommendations, we'd be more than happy to name a few of this week's faves for you. My uh -huh. personal pick would definitely be The Final Flight. I swear, none of the other books even come close to topping it. It's a forbidden romance between a commander and her airman. I promise oh you'll goodness. be sobbing like a baby when you get to the part where she orders her true love to charge into battle. Uh, spoilers, ma'am. Spoilers. Thanks for stopping by. Ah, I figured there had to be at least one up here. Ah, oh, Captain. Perfect timing. I'm picking out a present for my girlfriend. Which do you think she'd like more? The machine gun brooch or the bayonet one? Dude, you've got to be kidding me. Bullshit. Sorry, sir. He's being an idiot. You're not wrong. People. Seven. Outside. Yes, yes sir. sir. Oh, I still can't get over the shitty marching. I love how <laughs> Take your time looking around. Quality guaranteed. Sir, are you all right? You uh, you've been you've been huffing a little much there. A little concerning. <laughs> Knock him dead at the parade. Dude, he sounds like he's not even gonna make it to the parade. Thanks for stopping by. Red! <laughs> nice uniforms. Aw, how'd you know it was us? By your scent. That is some nose you got there, Red. Leaving the Mako-soaked streets of Midgar behind has done wonders for my faculties. Though this place is starting to take its toll. <laughs> uh, barracks. Uh, oh, hey, we got a couple up here. Are you to participate in today's parade? Very. All of us in the seventh have been practicing like. I'm sorry to interrupt this interview. Excuse me, but we're in the middle of an interview. Oh. Uh, good day, Captain. Uh, oh, you're their captain. This is perfect. If you have a moment, I'd love to ask you some questions about the parade. Oh dear. Uh, sorry, but. How do you plan to set your oh, team God. apart from the competition? <laughs> Are there any special routines you've been practicing? We, uh... Oh. Right! I see what you mean, Captain! We can't go spilling our secrets to anyone who asks, especially on camera. Nice save, Trooper! Over, people. <laughs> the parade's about to begin. Follow me. Sir! <laughs> You know, I half expected the reporter to march out. You have rounded up the requisite five units, but I've still got to find five more. Yeah, I'm back on planetary blessings again. Hey, there's another group that was up here. The president showed himself. Where's he been? Not in Midgar, that's for sure. Seeing the world, maybe? Good. Kids got a lot to learn. Not now, buddy. We're busy. Oh! Captain, I didn't realize! Sorry, sir! Practice is over. Time for the real deal. With me. Yes, yes sir! sir. Ah! Well, at least they're easy to get along with. The heck are you guys eating up here? What's with all the damn styrofoam? Come on! Look at this guy. I can't wait to see the mobile unit tear it up to the city. In a few hours, he will take part in his Nope, don't see any red in here. Ah, there's a group though. Call me biased if you wish, but. I believe our Afrit formation is the pinnacle of perfection. I don't know. The Grenadier's Rameau is pretty tight, too. Nothing beats the Riot Trooper's Shiva formation. It's rock solid. Hmm. If only we could come up with a formation that allowed all of our troops to shine. The President's commendation would be as good as ours. Hmm. Huh. Interesting Captain. idea. Sir, permission to ask a question. What formations do you intend to utilize for our performance? Uh... That depends on the readiness of my men. 
but you can rest assured that your captain has everything under control. Is that clear? Now, out! Sir! Yes, yes sir! sir. <laughs> nice save, Cloud. <laughs> oh, bonus! Damn. Nice bonus. 1,500 big ones. Junon is winning that commendation. Not on my watch, you're not. Huh? Chadley! Don't talk to no matter what happens, no hard feelings. May the best unit win. What the devil are you doing here, buddy? After I'm done studying, Seriously! Stress. My stomach can't handle it. Good day. Is there something I can help you with? It's me, Stand. Chadley. Potential research candidate confirmed. Hmm. Huh. Cloud? Why in the world are you wearing that uniform? On second thought, forget I asked. The less I know about your undercover pursuits, the better. Good idea. If you require assistance, let me know. Now then, Captain, how might I help you today? <laughs> uh, yeah, we're still maxed out on this. Needless to say, many hazards await you on the road, so take care. <laughs> uh, seriously, Chadley, man. A hell of a place to be blending in. All right. Still got to find three more units. Where would they be? I haven't checked much of the lower section yet. I should also check this top section. Oh, hi. Yeah, there's one. Le soirée. Oh, yeah. Once the parade's over, I'll be officially joining the counter-terrorism unit. Shit. I know. They haven't even told me where I'm going to be stationed. This sucks. Well, we'll just have to make the most of the time we got. And on and that note, your time's up. We're kind of in the middle of something. Check the helmet. Oh, Captain, I, I didn't. I'm sorry, sir. Break time's over. Outside. Now. Yes, sir. Oh, the counterterrorism unit? Well, that means I'm probably going to be murdering you later. <laughs> I'm sorry in advance. All right, so I got to find two more groups. That looks like a group of potential soldiers I could recruit. Yep, red armbands. Damn. What? We're trying to enjoy the view. It's the captain. Oh, um, I, uh, captain. Get your shit together. Parade's about to begin. Everyone, follow me. Yes, yes sir. Ah, <sighs> my, 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 my. All right, I just need to find one last group. Now, where would they be? Yeah, hold your horses, guys. Hmm? Rude. Uh oh. The fuck? Is this some sort of club? Is this some sort of club for bald people? The Glabrescent. Oh, the Glabrescent Bar. Okay, well, I'm very curious. Maybe we'll find our last unit in here. Or maybe we'll find Root and Barrett sharing a drink. <laughs> oh dear. Oh my god. First time. If you want to drink with us, you're gonna have to lose the helmets. No scalp, no service. <laughs> <laughs> that is what? definitely the uh, the title of this episode. What are you waiting for? Unless are you three mop heads? Wait! He's our new captain. He didn't know. Sir, this place is for the clean shaven. You need to prove that you belong or leave. Uh. RR's over, people. Seventh, outside. Sir, right away, sir. 
<laughs> Whew. I saved my blonde hair. God damn, seventh assemble. Oh my god. <laughs> that might have been the funniest thing we've seen in a good long while. And look at us, we got a full squad here. Ah, uh, soldiers, it is time to call it a day. That's right, we're gonna save this for another day. Ah, uh, but it was so good to get everybody here. I needed that, that was a good chuckle. Thank you for that, that was beautiful. <laughs> anyway, if you've enjoyed this, please leave a like and favorite and subscribe to join me for more freaking shenanigans like this. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. And where's Barrett anyway? <laughs>